Welcome back to Pixel Village and I am Radha Krishnan. Due to popular demand, we are back again with another video on mobile phone photography. Before we start, let me thank you for the overwhelming support that you people extended to our video on mobile phone photography. Now as we speak, we are somewhere around 3.7 million views and uh, counting. Thank you very much. Okay, this time we're going to introduce you to few accessories to improve mobile phone photography. As you know, the mobile phone has only one lens. Some of the newer ones and some of the expensive ones have multiple lenses. One for a wide angle photography, one for a little telephoto photography, some for macro, some for black and white, depends on models, it keeps varying. Anyway, predominantly these days, most of the phones, especially the ones in the budget range, come with just one lens. As a mobile phone photographer, I'm sure at some point you felt the need for a telephoto lens, a wide angle lens, and sometimes even a macro lens, and also a fisheye lens at times. Because you know, your interest is to shoot very well. You want to take your game to the next level. So this particular set of lens that is uh, available to you, using which you can do all that. So as usual, let's get into the shoot and uh, let me explain to you as the shoot progresses. Off to the shoot. So our scene is set here. We have our Shikari Shambhu here and we have two dangers lurking right behind them. Of course, we have our equipment. We're going to tackle the situation with uh, all these devices that we have. Just make sure that the lens is clean. If it is not clean, then use the cleaning cloth, which is provided along with each kit. So just wipe it clean. And in the camera app, activate the grid as usual. Okay, I'm going to first shoot this scene with the in-camera lens. Okay, let me switch on. So let me take a shot. So that's the uh, clip-on uh, adapter. Place it carefully on top of the lens on the mobile phone. Pick the uh, lens of your choice. So let me pick one which is really wide. It's called the fish eye. It's very easy to mount. There's a bayonet mount. Pick it, align to the mount and one turn and you can hear a click. Okay, and wow, the typical curved horizons. Now I have everything in my frame. Okay, then let me pick the wide angle, which is the 18 mm. The lenses that come with the camera predominantly are in the range of 21 mm to 24, 28 mm usually. So this 18 mm will convert that into a wider angle. So, here it is. Oh, nice and wide. Okay. Now let me switch to something called the standard angle. Now the standard angle will technically become a tele lens for mobile phone, okay? This is a 60 mm. 60 mm even to a typical DSLR will start moving into the tele range. A nice portrait lens in fact. So this will give you telephoto kind of a feel. Look at this image, wonderful. 
I am shooting this image with the mobile phones on camera. The foreground and the background is almost equally in focus. I am going to add the 60mm to the mobile phone and let's see what happens now. The foreground is nicely separated from the backdrop because of that blurry bokeh in the backdrop. And if you still want to go close, there is a macro lens. It will go really close. So I can go as close as this. See, this is how close you can go to him. I'm sure can go even closer. Yeah, that's nice. So let me go close to the T-Rex. T-Rex is slowly coming into focus. Yeah, you can focus even on the teeth of the T-Rex. Nice. Let's go to this guy here. You can go really close. So now you know how all these lenses can be put into creative views. We just used some interesting elements to kind of, you know, showcase it to you. But you can use it in your day-to-day -day life. Inside your home, a party, a picnic, just name it. Well, restaurant, food shots, flowers, anything that you want to shoot, you can shoot with it. Now we will see how this uh, selfie stick can be used very creatively. Basically, you can use this when you want to uh, shoot time lapses, when you want to shoot in low light, or you want to take, of course, a selfie. The prime reason why anyone would change their mobile phone is for a better camera, not for its call-making capability. The advantage of having the Sirui sets of lenses is that the universal adapter allows you to attach these sets of lenses with any phone whether it is an economy range or a mid-range or even a flagship range of phones. The economy and the mid-range mobile phone photographer is definitely going to be benefited by these lenses. Let me talk about the flagship uh, phone user. Most flagship phones have multiple lenses on their cameras, each one doing a different job. The maximum resolution is usually assigned only to one lens. The other two lenses get much lesser resolution. But when you use lenses like these with the universal adapter, you can choose that particular lens with the maximum resolved sensor behind it to get all your shots. Which means if you have a camera which has, let's say, 20 megapixels, usually their portrait lens and their black and white lens don't have the same resolution. They are usually much lesser. So if you use these lens and use this universal adapter on to that lens with maximum resolution, you can get your fisheye, your wide angle, your standard shots and your portrait shots and your macro shots with the maximum resolution. So if you are someone who wants to take your mobile phone photography to the next level, well, you can consider this as the first accessory that you may want to acquire. Bye for now.